Welcome to Half Moon Cay, the heavenly private island with crystal clear water and powder soft sand. It may inspire you to stay a while and make you crave coming back. It does live up to the hype, so let's go check it out. This is the island map to get a sense of where we will be going. First at the bottom of the map is the tender port, and this is right next to the shopping area and also a close beach access. It's super convenient. And we'll be going all the way up the beach where you're going to find more food, drinks, and activities. But first we're going to start at the port shopping area. I like this port shopping area a lot. It's really clean and cute. There's local musicians that play. There's a pretty fountain and a fun bar and also lots of shops. And just behind the information booth on the left when you come in is the closest beach access. It's pretty great. There's a rental shop, a kid's splash area, and a luxury private cabana right there. This area is one of the more popular being the closest, which is great if you're just a drop and swim kind of person. If you're looking for a chair, it may be a problem if you're not coming early. You can find less busy places up the beach and lots more to do, which is where we're heading next. Up the beach, you're going to find lots of pretty views with greenery and beach and benches, and you're going to want to take a lot of photos. There's a bar and lobster shack. This place has an amazing view, and it was really hot walking around, and I didn't have any problem asking for ice water. Further down, you're going to find water activity rentals, beach bikes, and kayaks, and beautiful, colorful cabanas. A must-see is this shipwreck bar, Captain Morgan's Bar. It's a well-themed pirate bar surrounded by amazing beauty. You'll also find a church, basketball court, kids' playground, and a massage parlor. Finally, the barbecue restaurant, Island Barbecue. It's buffet-style barbecue, and they have plenty of picnic table seating Behind the barbecue, there's a trail to the stingrays, water sports, and horseback riding. It's quite a walk, especially if it's hot, and I did see transport at the port shopping area for excursions. In summary, this is a nice port. If the weather cooperates for the tender, it's clean, it's cute, it's beautiful, 
It has a lot to do. And of course, the unexpected powder sand in that clear water might just pull you in, fill you with joy, make you want to come back again and again. And that concludes my tour today. Thanks so much for watching and enjoy your stay at Half Moon Cave.